Hey guys, it's Brittany. And Melanie. Welcome back to our channel. So today we have a Disney haul. Um, some of this comes from the Disney outlet store in Branson, Missouri. And some of this, um, some of these items are Disney items from Hot Topic that we found. Melanie actually found them. And then I had to order a bunch of them because they were just so cute. So I think we're gonna start with the Hot Topic okay. haul first, just to kind of show you what Disney merch we found on their website. You wanna just hold some of them up? Yeah, that's fine. Um, so they are these cute little pillows and they have these cute little arms and these cute little legs. And they are some of the Disney Park icons. They remind me so much of like Wishables. They, they had, do, but they're a lot bigger They had than a Wishable series that literally was this. I'm gonna let you show that one because I know it's your favorite. I'm gonna show it in comparison to a Wishable. This is one of the Wishables that I found at the Disney Outlet store. So quite a bit bigger, but I wouldn't necessarily think of this as a pillow because it's just not- I don't think not... they're called pillows, they're plushes. Yeah, yeah, I mean, but- They're by Funko. They're, they're very flat. If yeah, I they're if super cute. That. I thought about putting them on a couch and using them as like, Pillow decor, but I think they're too small for that. But they have these cute little arms. This is obviously the Tree of Life. This is the back. They were on sale, so they were ten dollars a piece. And the tag even says Walt Disney World plushies. It's fiftieth celebration. It looks like the retail price is twelve dollars and ninety cents. So we got like a few dollars off. And they had um, this is obviously Epcot. This one is my absolute favorite. I'm obsessed with the Tower of Terror. Tower of Terror. Look at his cute little uh, cheeks. He's so cute. And a little storm cloud brewing in. And then we've got Space Mountain. I will say. Which is obviously for Magic Kingdom. But Space Mountain really confused me because he's not one of the icon wishable sets. It was the castle, Tower of Terror, um, the Epcot Ball, Spaceship Earth and the Tree of Life. I could see those being the icons. This is extra for Magic Kingdom. It's a ride in yeah. Magic Kingdom. So it's a little bit different. I do love Space Mountain. So we obviously had to get that. We each got a set of these because we thought they were just so cute. They but really um, cute. I did think it was weird that that was the only extra ride that they put in. Like it doesn't signify like just a specific part yeah. because this signifies or is significant to Magic Kingdom. But these are all super which cute. One's, I know which one your favorite is. It's the Tower of Terror. Mine is, yes, definitely the Tower of Terror. Honestly, the Tower of Terror might be my favorite as well. I just think that that one's There's really cute. not a whole lot of Tower of Terror merch, which I think is why Tower of Terror is my favorite. But you'll have to comment down below and let us know which of these is your favorite. And did you get any of these? I'm not sure if they have them online still. Um, somebody had posted them in a Facebook group, a Disney Facebook group that Melanie follows. And so she texted me right away and she was like, oh my gosh, have you we seen have these? Have these? We have to have them. And I got on and I got them like super fast. So mm -hmm. I was really excited about those. So let us know down below, which one is your favorite? What would you want? Um, the rest of the items I actually got from the Branson Disney outlet store. So we have some wishables, like unbaggings and unboxings and stuff that we can do. So first I'm gonna start with the stuff that I don't have to unbag or unbox. They had some of their Christmas stuff and I had to get this really cute Disney Christmas countdown and it's got Minnie and Mickey and they look like they're on a winter snow lodge and you can change the numbers obviously right there and I thought this was super cute. It was originally 50 and I got it for 20, 19.98. But I thought this was super, super cute and I had to have it. And it looks like you got another countdown calendar. I did this one I thought would be really, really cute to put on like my work desk or up on top of my cubbies. Oh, that would be cute. Um, so and that's one for work. Yes, and this one says happy birthday, so it could be a birthday countdown, but you can also change this one down here, because on the back you can change it to say like a Disney countdown, birthday countdown, Christmas countdown, or Paradise Falls countdown, like if you're going on a different type of vacation. This was originally $24.99, and I got it for $9.98, but I do like Up, and I thought that that was super, super cute. I love the house from Up. It's so pretty. And they got a little, a little gonna great live soda it. one right mm -hmm. there. I like that a lot. 
The next thing I got, I was super, super excited about this. They had the Hocus Pocus Lounge Fly Wallet. This was originally 50 and I got it for $24.98. It's got the little cauldron on the back, super cute. And it's very like metallic -y. super pretty. I'm gonna show you the inside. It's very like, ooh, shiny. Shiny, but then they also have back here, and it's really hard to see. I don't know if you'll be able to see it because of the tag, but they have like the little candelabra and they oh, even okay. have- So it like matches that lounge fly backpack. Yes, and they have a skull down there too. Nice. But I thought that this was super cute and it was half price, so I definitely wanted it. I have a Hocus Pocus wallet too. Oh, mine's, look at the twinsies. Yeah, mine's not over here, otherwise I'd show y'all. They also had some wishables and um, wishables are actually $14.99, so they're like really expensive now. They used to be $9.99 and then they went up to $12.99 and now they're $14.99 for this little bitty tiny plush. And I wasn't going to keep collecting all the wishables and there's a few of the sets that I just don't really care for, like the Incredibles one. I like the movie Incredibles, but it's not one of my favorites, so I'm not gonna collect that one. But since we were there and I saw the Lion King one and my boyfriend was like, it's Valentine's Day weekend, I'm gonna buy you whatever you want at the Disney store. And I was like, okay, let's go ahead and let's get some wishables. So they had Simba and he's super cute with his little tail. He was, like I said, $14.99. But then they had another open edition one that was on sale because it came out earlier this year or last year. I love this And one. it's the Headless Horseman and he's super cute. He was only $7.98, so he's like half price. And I've seen a couple of people who have um, surgically removed um, the Headless Horseman with his um, pumpkin fiery head from the horse. And so they have the Headless Horseman and then the horse, which I'm not gonna do that because I like them together because I think he's super cute. But I thought he was adorable and I had to grab him. So now I think we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna dive into the blind bags. They had a whole bunch of these there, like I said, $14.99. Um, and since I was there, I was like, I kinda want the whole set. At first I was like, I just want Rafiki. Mm -hmm. And then I was like, my boyfriend was like, well, this one feels like it could be Timon or it could be Pumbaa or whatever. And I was like, well, if you get Timon, you have to have Pumbaa. If you get Pumbaa, you have to have Timon. So we kinda felt around and we tried to see what they all were. I don't think we got a Nala. That's what I'm thinking they didn't have. I know for sure, I'm pretty sure we should have a Rafiki. And we were thinking we may have found a Timon and a Pumbaa. But we'll just have to wait and see. Um, I think this is Pumbaa. You think that's Pumbaa? Yes. No. I think this one is Rafiki. And the way that I can tell here, I guess I should have showed you the options. So Simba is obviously the open edition, and then you can get Nala, Pumba, Timon, and Rafiki. Um, I don't think that they had like a chaser one. Sometimes they do that and sometimes they don't, but um, they're super, super cute. I always look on the back and see if there's anything that like stands out to me. Like Rafiki has his staff with a little, um, I don't think they're coconuts, but what oh, are- he's got stars for eyes. I know, they isn't it cute? Yeah, Wishables have stars for eyes. Okay. Um, like even the little horsey. The oh, the horse does, okay. Yeah, horse. I was, thought you were talking about the headless horse and I'm like, Brittany, he doesn't have a hat. <laughs> um, so I'm thinking that I can feel his staff right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna open this one and then I'll let you take a guess and you can open one. This is definitely cool. Um, I think I might cut them on the bottom. I've seen people cut the bottoms and that way the bag looks still intact. Cause when I go to uh, trade these, some people are really picky and they wanna keep the bag with them. So I'm gonna just cut a tiny hole in the bottom. That way, if somebody wants to keep the bag, they can. Look! You got an old man. I <laughs> got a little old Rafiki. He is so cute. Yeah, I definitely, this is what I was feeling. Oh, he's adorable. He's so cute. I like him so much. What fruit is that? That's what I was saying. Like, I wanted to say coconuts at first, but they're not because he gets some kind of orange stuff and rubs it on Simba's head. But it's a hard shell because it cracks it open. Yeah. Do you know what kind of fruit or veggie it is? Comment down below. I'm it not... doesn't matter. It's in the past. <laughs> He's so cute. I okay, love him. Let me see the scissors. I'm going to say that this is Pumba. Really. Mm. 
Your scissors are broken. <laughs> They're broken. Like, what's the matter with these scissors? They're legit broken. I think this might be another recipe, but I'm not 100% sure. Okay, so we're I said this was Pumba. It's Pumba! It's Pumba! I could feel his little things, but Stress. then I felt his tail. And I was like, oh yeah, this is for sure Pumba. Oh, his, his little hands are together. His yeah. hands are sewn together. Oh, he's cute. He is so Yay. cute. Not a dupe. I like him. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that this one is going to be Timon. I'm trying to feel for his little ears right here. So if you want to start collecting vegetables, try to look for like some really prominent features that you can feel for in the bag. And watch me, I'll probably be wrong. We'll look together. Oh, I was right. I did. I felt these oh. and I was like, he's having a bad hair day. <laughs> <laughs> Poor little Timon. Look at these Poor ears. Timon. Long, long. And just wrap them up, like swaddle them like a baby. He's so cute. See, I feel like if you get one, you have to get the other. Although, they're really the same size, which is strange, because Puma should be a lot bigger than you. Super cute. All right, what are you thinking? See the we got two more. or it's Nala. Ooh, let's go for Nala. Come on, Nala. But I don't know. It I'm thinking this is another Puma. This might be Rafiki. Yeah, this is Pumba. I can feel the tusks. Can you feel right there and tell me that that feels like... Nala doesn't have tusks, so. Yeah, well, if this is his tusk, he should have a tail right here. I don't feel his tail, though. Nala does not have tusks, so I don't think this is Nala. Do you want me to open this one, or are you thinking it's Rafiki? And you don't want to open it. Yeah, right there. That feels like a tusk. Yeah, this is his. Did you feel it too? I thought I did. I don't know if I should open them to trade them or leave them sealed to trade them. I don't know what people would want even more. Well, if you leave them sealed, you're never 100% sure. Yeah, I guess we'll go ahead and open it. You want me to open this one? Yeah, go for it. People watching are like, open it! We want to see! cannot. You got it. I see it. It's a tiny little You know what? You don't need all of these guys. Oh. It's Pimba. He was, he was upside down in the bag. He was upside down. Are we a pombo boy? A boy. We had a lot of war hogs. They'd be really like the Sanderson sisters. <laughs> <laughs> we are so weird. <laughs> we really are, but it's fine. Oh, well. I've got some traders oh, now. Hopefully... His hands are attached to his belly on this one. Oh, they are, yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, well. Maybe somebody will need a Pumba and will trade me a Nala. A Pumba or two. <laughs> yeah, two. I got two. Okay, that was fun. And at least I'm only missing one, so I can trade for it. That won't be that bad. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go to the next thing that I got at the Disney outlet shop, which is another mystery tin, but this is one of the popcorn rewind tins. And um, now was this on sale or was this full price? This was $8, yeah, $8.99. So it was like, this is normal price. But I will say the figures were bigger than I thought they were going to be. I guess I thought that they were gonna be like small, but they're actually decent size. Mm -hmm. um, and my boyfriend was like, go ahead and get it. You never know. And he tried to guess, and he said it's, um... How did he try to guess? Uh, because he went, mmm, let me feel it. Okay, well, that's what I was wondering. And then he said, it's going to be Ratatouille. Well, let me guess. <laughs> and then I told him I'd go ahead and open it, and we'd see if he was right. I think that it's pain and panic. Oh, I would love pain and panic. Okay, so I'm gonna show you some of the options right here. Um, we have, I almost said Hercules. Why would I do that? Hercules right here, pain and panic. You could have Quasimodo. Quasimodo. Um, they have Bolt, um, Remy from Ratatouille, 
this looks like bolt again to me. It does. So I'm it. really confused. Can I see? And then this is Bambi. And then it says collect mystery figure. Seven designs available. One, two, three, four, I five, six. I wonder if it's like a gold um, and bolt, maybe. I think that Pain and Panic or Bambi would be the best ones to get. But it says there's seven to choose from, and this is one, two, three, four, five, six. So there's obviously another mystery one. Oh. So I don't know. We'll see. We will see. And it comes in a cute little popcorn thing. Super excited. I've never gotten one of these before. And I think they do different series yeah. of these. Like, I think they have different options. Maybe the color of the popcorn bucket. I'm a little curious though. So, like, what do you do with the container after you open it? Um, at the Disney store, they had it set up um, to where they opened it and, because I want to say it, oh yeah, it opens like this. And they had it set up to where it was like sitting on the edge and you could see the figure on top. Okay, I got Quasimodo. This is a very big. Because I got the Quasimodo card. Did you though? Or are they tricking you? Or I'm does it always pretty come sure with I did. I wish it would come with Esmeralda because she's my favorite. I love Esmeralda. Well, that would mean I guess wrong and I don't think that would mean. Well, everybody gets wrong. Oh. No, Bird's cute. So I guess, where's my popcorn? Yeah, they had them set up like this. But how does, does that sit flat on a table, the popcorn? Um, it was sitting flat there. Okay. Super cute. And are you with that? I don't know that I would want to buy a whole bunch of these though, because if I got dupes, what do I do with that? You trade them. Do you though? I don't know if there is a rewind trading place. You know what's funny? Uh is that he looks like the little figure that Quasimodo makes. Like he, whenever he like makes the little village, like like little... they're like all have like the little thing like this that he carved out of wood. They're so cute. That's what he is. Hmm. Interesting. Quasi was probably the one that I'd want the Wanted least. the least. Yeah, like if I got Remy, I could set him up in my kitchen, you know, he'd be super cute. Um, well, and I mean, like, I think, I feel like they made him look worse here. Look at his eye. What is wrong with well, it? Well, I was going to say, he, he looks a little scary looking at the bird he like that. He looks like he had, like, he's blind in one eye and that it's also maybe falling out of his skull. That's terrifying. Oh, my gosh. Look at, here, you, you I really show, show, show them his eye. They definitely just don't like that. But I don't know. Maybe somebody will want him. I mean, I he's love sweet. The arm here, though. He's, they didn't do a great job with that arm here. Um, he's okay. Not the one I would have wanted. I probably would have wanted Remy or Bambi or any of the other ones. But I would have wanted Pain and Panic. I think they though you're really cute. Yeah, I love Pain and Panic. I love Hercules. 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 Okay, so the last thing that I have um, actually came from Disney World when we went on our last trip. I got a couple of pin boxes, and these were the new ones, and I'm really excited. So I'm going to start with this one. This is the Beauty and the Beast set. Um, I don't have any of these. I don't know if I can zoom in or not to let you see them. And I will tell you the options, though. You can get, oh, man, that's hard to see. Oh, wow, you can get the kitchen stove. That's an interesting one. I haven't seen that one before. Lumiere, Mrs. Potts, um, the Feather Duster, Chip, Maurice, Cogsworth, the um, Armoire. Uh, oh, I thought she was the boudoir. You could, uh, you could get the old judge that like tries to throw Maurice in the Ooh. jail. He's creepy. I would want him the least. Um, Gaston. Oh, you can, you can get, get the, the little footstool, dog. footstool. He's cute. And then you can get the coat rack. You can't get Belle. Yeah, these are um, celebrating 30 years. 30th anniversary pin set. Well, I think they're just want? supposed to be the sidekicks. sidekicks. You get two. I wouldn't mind like Chip and Mrs. Potts or Lumiere and Cogsworth. I wouldn't mind getting 
um, the footstool. Mm -hmm. Pretty much the only ones that I wouldn't want would be the creepy old judge, the coat rack, or the stove. I love how you're like, that's so interesting. I don't want it. <laughs> well, I don't know. It's just weird. All right, gonna go ahead and just dive right on into this. If you're taking a guess as to what I get, guess it now. What do you think I'm getting? I think you're getting what you don't want, because that's our look. I, yeah, I would feel, but they all feel the same. It's supposed to be a pen that looks like a book that's open, and it's one of the pages coming you're out. You're gonna get the stove, and you're gonna get the footstool. Stove and the footstool. Oh, I would like the footstool. And the stove wouldn't be that bad. I just really don't want the judge. I'm gonna show you first, guys. It's, it's the it's judge. Probably Did the we judge. Quit here now? Oh no! Look! Oh, she's so cute. It's the dresser that sings to her. Aw, this is a good one. I don't mind this one at all. That's a very nice one. Good. Okay. Because it's the one you have. Woohoo! Go me. Let's look at the next one. Okay. I don't know if it goes this way or. It's Maurice. Look at him. Aw. He's cute too. Not bad, not bad at all. See the little book and he's one of the pages coming up. I like that. I didn't get two of these because I was like, I don't want duplicates, but I do collect Beauty and the Beast. So those can both go on my pen board. The next one I have is Distinctively Disney Dining. And it's a nine pin collection, whereas the Beauty and the Beast one was a 12 pin collection. So a little bit smaller, um, but these are all characters that are dining. So you can get Lady and the Tramp at Tony's Restaurant. You can get Lilo Winston. and Stitch. You can get Remy. You can get Mike and uh, Celia. You can get, oh, I haven't seen this one. It looks like, kind of looks like Goofy is a waiter and Minnie's going to eat there? I don't know. I don't think it is goofy, but it kind of looks a little bit like him. They have one with Baymax, which Baymax, I don't know. I, I'm a little that confused That might be now. from the show. I don't know. Oh, yeah, TV show. Okay. Um, They have, oh, Tiana and her mom. That one's cute. Oh my gosh, this is the one I want the absolute most. It is the Emperor's New Groove, and it is Cusco <laughs> and Pacha at the restaurant. Please let me get that one. And then they have Rapunzel, okay? So, oh, please, 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 please. What's the other one you want? You get two. I don't care. I just want, I just want Emperor's New Groove. Okay, fair enough. I collect Emperor's New Groove. I don't really collect any of these other ones. Tiana would be cute. And Tiana so would, would be cute. And Lady the Tramp. Yes. Please. This is also a limited release. I really, really want him. No whammies, no whammies, no whammies. Okay, this is, um, no, it's not goofy. It just looked like it from a ways away. It says Cafe Mini. So it's Minnie Mouse. I'm not sure. Who is that man, Minnie? You have some splaining to do. <laughs> Last chance. Last chance. I'm not going to get it. I'm going to be so sad. Just don't look. I'm not gonna look. I'm not looking. I'm not looking. Uh, oh, it's Remy. He's cute. Um, not I the bet one a lot I wanted. Of people would want the Remy one though, so I bet you could trade it for Pacha. Yeah, I bet I could. He's so cute. I do like this one, but I really, really, really wanted him for a groove. Sad day. Maybe somebody will trade with me. If you have the Emperor's New Groove one and you want one of the ones that I have, or if you want both of them, I'll try them both for them because I really, really, really want Emperor's New Groove. Just um, comment down below and let us know. <sighs> that was a big haul. Yeah. They took a lot out of me. I'm tired now. <laughs> it's bedtime. <laughs> oh, it is bedtime. <laughs> it is pretty late, not going to lie. And I have work in the morning. Um, comment down below what your favorite item was. And if you want to trade with me, because I really, really, really want him for his new group. Uh, what's your favorite item? I really do like him. He's so, so cute. He's adorable. Um, if I had to pick, I don't know. I really like, I really like the wallet. I really like the Tower of Terror. I really like this. Ugh. 
is so big. You gotta pick one. Uh, one of them? Yes. Ah! Okay, well then I guess I'm gonna say... That one! Then I'm gonna say that one. Um, mm, I can't decide. I like them all. I have a problem. I have a really serious problem. Um, I'm just gonna say... I'm gonna say the countdown. Because it's super cute. The and it's Christmas big. one? Yes. It's adorable and it's gonna go great for the holidays. Yeah, that'll be really cute. Alright guys, we hope that you enjoyed this video. Um... Don't forget to leave a like, and if you're not subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe, and we will see you guys in our next video.